That is a 40th anniversary pin and not given to many people, Mr. Allison. He is, of course, a senior. senior yeah, sorry. <laughs> uh, senior vice president here at Spruce Meadows. True, you started on day one. I did. I started here. Uh, I was at the opening ceremonies in April of 75 and started here at the first tournament in 76 as a high school student. Uh, Henry Wisewood. Correct. Henry Wisewood. U of go, A. Saints. Go Warriors. Go Warriors. Go Warriors. I never leave a warrior behind. <laughs> you know that. Uh, we just walked out of a pit. What is this? Uh, that's called the Devil's Dyke. It's one of the natural obstacles here on the All Canada Ring. We also have them at other rings, including the International Ring here at Spruce Meadows. It's used primarily for speed events and then, oh, of course, man. in the Derby on the weekend. 40th anniversary. Who would have thunk it? Well, it's a very different place. Then and now has been our theme Jeez. for the 40th anniversary. You couldn't see the city of Calgary when Spruce Meadows first opened, and population was about 300,000. Now My it's about 1.3 million, and vet riders from 57 nations compete here. 10 million people come through the gates Jeez. over the history. That's You know what? And we love the fact that it's a mainstay here in Calgary. When people talk of Calgary, they always talk about Spruce Meadows. What do you have in store for us this year, the 40th anniversary year? Well, it's really been a time to... Uh, Take the then and now approach, yep. uh, salute our founders, not only Ron and Mark Southern, but also uh, our founding volunteers, our corporate partners, the mm -hmm. athletes, uh, uh, the fans, the school tours program that's been mm -hmm. going on for 40 years. Uh, a big initiative has been the creation of Founders Plaza uh, to the west of us here, which has been under construction since the... The snowfall of yeah, last yeah, yeah. September, and uh, a homecoming of sorts. But you know where we are now on the world stage of sport is also very important. No question. We have the best in the world here. Uh, the Pan Am Games are later this year, and the Canadians need to qualify for the Olympics, so they're so here they preparing. Come here. Yeah, yeah. So are all of the the athletes from throughout the Americas: uh, Venezuela, Brazil, Chile, Mexico. Uh, there's a lot of Spanish being spoken on the grounds right now. You and I have talked on countless occasions, Ian, about this place. And when it marks the 40th anniversary, is there part of you that just reflects back and says, man, I was a part of this? Yeah, it is really interesting, and especially when you, you, know, you know, take that sort of role in the organization, having yeah. come through every aspect of it. It's been a part of uh, some of the greatest moments in the history of this sport. So right? you know, Big Ben and Hickstead and John Whitaker with Milton. And then the other things that have happened here at Spruce Meadows. Uh, the International Christmas Market's become huge, hosting sure. the G8 and the World Petroleum Congress. Uh, uh, it's different. Spruce Meadows is d uh, different things to different people. Uh, the flowers, the parades, trout fishing on the pond. It's, uh, it's, it it's, it's unlike amazing. anything anything <laughs> around here. And if you haven't stopped and said hi to, to Ian and all the folks here at Spruce Meadows, you must try this out. Uh, thank you, Ian. Thank you. Uh, we're going to talk with uh, Linda Southern uh, Heathcott in just a few moments as well, too, about this place and some of the great initiatives as well, too, here at Spruce Meadows. More coming up on Shaw. Can we jump over this thing? Is that yeah. wrong? Would that be bad? you got to jump with the flat red flag on your own. <laughs>